Hello dear friend, dear meditator, welcome back to our YouTube channel for another guided meditation. I am your host, your guide, and as always I am truly honoured to be a part of your journey. If you enjoy these meditations, you might also enjoy getting a new meditation every single day. I post daily meditations on Patreon. By becoming a patron, you get daily downloadable meditations, as well as exclusive videos and content, monthly Zoom meetings with me, Q&A sessions, and special discounts on upcoming courses and meditation retreats. Not only will you enjoy all these perks, you will be supporting the channel in our mission to simplify and demystify meditation, transcendence and awakening, and spread these beautifully simple techniques to the world. So please do have a look and sign up now on www.patreon.com slash Raphael Writer. That's Patreon, P-A-T-R-E-O-N dot com slash Raphael Writer. All the links and information are available in the description notes under this video. So without further ado, let us begin on today's meditation. Make sure you won't be disturbed during the entirety of this meditation. If you need to do so, put your phone on flight mode. Do this now so that you're not disturbed later on. Take a seat, nice and comfortably, sitting nice and tall, nice and proud, with dignity. Sit as you would imagine your best self would be sitting and experiencing your existence during this meditation session. Today will be a vibrational meditation, a meditation for transcendence. Transcendence means to go beyond. To go beyond what? Well, to go beyond who we are today in order to experience who we really are at the core of our being, our highest self, our natural self, our self at full potential, full capabilities. Our self present here and now. And so let's begin. We start all of these meditations by dedicating it to somebody, someone, a group of people. It can be anybody, somebody that you love, somebody that you're having challenges with currently. It doesn't matter. Whoever you choose. The process is very simple. We start by closing our eyes. Hands to the heart, either in a praying position or flat on the chest. Whatever feels more natural. There's no special magic way. Just make it your way. Deep breath in through the nose. And on the exhalation, we project our love, gratitude and appreciation towards that person. Imagine that person receiving your dedication, your energy, your love. At the end of the meditation, when we've created a sense of calm, I will share with you a little idea to contemplate on. And for now, I will start introducing the sound, the vibration. Gradually but surely, put your attention very gently, effortlessly on the vibration, putting it on the foreground of your mind. And stay there during the entirety of the meditation. When thoughts come, don't try to eliminate the thoughts. Don't judge the thoughts. Don't judge yourself for thinking. Don't judge the meditation. Release your opinions. Release your expectations and just be. And so when you find yourself lost in autonomous thought, simply go back to the vibration. Put it back on the foreground of your mind, on the center stage of your inner personal space. When the sound fades out, reproduce it for a few extra moments in your own mind, letting it resonate naturally.
finally now let's go of the vibration the meditation is over taking a nice deep breath opening your eyes if you feel like it smiling if you need to <laughs> wiggling stretching starting to move your body as you get reacquainted to the sensations of your physical being before i leave you i would like to share with you a thought on enlightenment and awakening it was of course a subject that i've pondered on many times and i would like you to do the same right now here's the idea here's the concept and let me know how it resonates with you I don't think that there is a way to prove or to answer the question whether enlightenment is a permanent state or like everything else, an impermanent state, a fleeting state. What we can do, on the other hand, is to show that everyone has the innate ability to have a glimpse of what it means to be fully awake. And even these short moments, sometimes microseconds, can liberate you from suffering as you get a peek of the true nature of your own consciousness. Now that may happen during the meditation, after the meditation, before the meditation. It can happen at any time. When you start realizing that the skin of your body doesn't act like a wall but like a bridge. That you're not only in the world, but you are the world. so much for being here today for taking the time and giving yourself the opportunity the gift of being present in the moment of being calm of stillness and experiencing the core of who you really are remember that it doesn't matter if today was deep or not so deep it is all part of a process the important thing is to keep practicing and to make your mindfulness and meditative practices as consistent as you can. If you're interested, remember that you can have access to daily meditations with me, as well as other cool perks by becoming a supporter of Meditation with Raphael on Patreon. I highly recommend that you subscribe to my weekly letter that I send out once a week, where I share thoughts on meditation, mindfulness, self-transcendence, and living a great life, as well as news on the content I post on the podcast, on YouTube, and on the blog. You can sign up there for free directly on my website, www.raphaelwriter.com. Have a look at the links in the show notes for the Patreon page, the podcast, the links to the blog, the free weekly letter, and ways to get in touch with me. I always love hearing from you, so do not hesitate to send me a message on Twitter or Instagram or directly on my email. Don't forget to subscribe to this channel, to share these meditations with anybody that might benefit from them. And until next time, remember that I see you, I feel you, and I appreciate you. Take care. Bye-bye.